The government highlighted the technologies applied in smart lampposts during a briefing today. The smart devices are able to collect real-time city data, including meteorological and air quality data, as well as traffic snapshot images. Privacy protection measures are in place, including cameras set to face and take pictures of public areas only. The lampposts do not carry any facial recognition function. Images taken will not be sent to any third party for facial recognition applications. In addition, some of the lamppost's functions will not be activated at this stage, including the Environmental Protection Department's monitoring of illegal dumping with the aid of cameras located near black spots, and the Transport Department's assessment of road use by different types of vehicles enabled by Bluetooth traffic detectors and cameras collecting car plate numbers. We understand that there, recently there is uh, public concern about using the smart lamp holes uh, uh, and the smart device that will have some potential uh, invasion of uh, the personal privacy or collecting uh, the personal information. So that's why we, uh, we have decided to put on hold three such applications and also will conduct a wider public consultation in order to explain to the public. The multifunctional smart lampposts pilot scheme is a three-year program in which some 400 smart lampposts will be installed in phases in districts with higher pedestrian and traffic flow to promote smart city development and support 5G mobile network construction.